Hello, my name is Ben Williams. I'm a 29 year old firefighter from Southampton. In April 2012, I'm going to run the hardest foot race on earth for the Wessex Cancer Trust. In 2002, my mother Glenda got diagnosed with breast cancer. My mum was everything to me. She drove me to all my football lessons, took me to cadets, was always there at every prize giving every pass out parade in the army, everything that I ever did, she was there. In 2006, I had a severe accident, which put me in a wheelchair for nearly a year. I was in the south of France at the time, and at that time as well, my mum was receiving chemotherapy. With complete disregard for her own illness, she traveled to the south of France to come and take care of me and bring me home. During my re rehabilitation at this time, trying to get back on my feet and trying to learn to walk again was hard enough, but my mum didn't even mention once her own illness. She didn't whinge about it, she didn't talk about her bad days where she could barely get out of bed. She just tended to me and tried to get me back on my feet and encouraged me to get back to the active Ben that she knew. I was back on my feet by 2007, around about the time that she died. She spent the last 12 months looking after me before she died. And that made me want to give back more than anything. Her determination to get me back on my feet as a mother to her son taught me more about life than anything I'd ever done in the previous years that I'd lived. For the next year after that, I went around the country doing half marathons, marathons, triathlons, 10Ks to raise money for breast cancer care. And obviously making a difference, albeit a small difference, you know, made me feel slightly better about giving back to my mother's memory. In 2007, I started training a young racing driver named Dean Stoneman. Watching such a talented young man progress through the ranks of motorsport was quite inspirational and it was something that I wanted to help with. I started doing Dean's sports conditioning and personal fitness training and making sure he was strong and fit enough to drive the car. He didn't like that bit too much, he just wanted his bum in the seat of a car, but albeit he had to do the fitness. And we, we grew quite close as friends during this period. In 2010, Dean went on to become the FIA Formula 2 champion. Uh, a moment that was, you know, I was really proud of him. He, he progressed all the way from karting to Formula 2 and came out as number one. And I was really proud to be part of his team. Unfortunately for Dean, in January 2011, he got diagnosed with testicular cancer. And this hit home again quite hard after watching my mother go through the same thing. In 2012, I'm going to run across the Sahara Desert because I wanted to simulate prolonged suffering for myself. Because Dean and my mother have been through the same thing. Cancer isn't over in a day. And we can't help with it. We can't take their chemotherapy for them. We can't make their pain go away. So I'm just gonna try and make a small difference by raising money for the Wessex Cancer Care. A cancer trust that support Dean through his treatment. Now I'm going to ask you guys to help me by supporting me do this. So if you can follow me on my website or click on my Facebook page, that would be really helpful. And also if you just go to the top right hand corner and you're in a position to donate, click the donate button and that will take you through to my Just Giving site and all the money goes straight to Wessex Cancer Trust. I hope to see you along the way and I'll hopefully see you all soon. Cheers.